All right, this video is for Book Club Points Programming Challenge 415. Book Club Points. Serendipity Booksellers, excuse me, has a book club that awards points to its customers based on the number of books purchased each month. The points are awarded as follows. If the customer purchases zero books, he or she earns zero points. If the customer pur pur purchases one book, he or she earns five points. If the customer pur purchases two books, they earn 15 points. Purchase three books, 30 points. Or four or more books, they purchase 60 points. Write a VB application that lets the user enter the number of books. That's the user has purchased this month and displays the number of points awarded okay so we did that and here is the first label which is the um, LVL amount of books enter the number of books and LVL num books here we got our second label amount of points earned LVL points here I got a third label points earned so this is going to display a result of whatever it is we enter whatever number we enter in this amount books the textbooks that we bought that this will label display so the first thing I did obviously is with the close statement which is me uh, close and then the next thing I did, because originally I had an extra text box on there instead of the label result box. And so I entered that there. I could probably erase that here. That's we're on this one now. So we clear the text boxes here. And then we empty the label output box there with the string empty. So that's the difference. The labels, the, the text. You use the string dot empty, and then we reset the the textbook to the the very first text box, and then we perform our calculation. And what I figured out we needed was we needed probably two integers to determine the number of books and the number of points. And since they're not there's no decimal in the amount of points earned, they're both integers, and the, you can't buy a a part of a, a, a book you can't buy like 1.2 books so that's an integer as well so then we put the number of books into your for your textbook the, the text box input here and then we did the calculation for our logic so we got the so if our number of books is one then we earn five points here so we put five into the number of points we earned then we put in our label output our text is five points. Then we put an else if it is two, then the number of points is five. So then we get 15 points. And then if three, then we get 30 points. And we get the 30 points. Else if it's greater than three, because it said if it's four you get 60 or four or more it's 60 so it's greater than three and you get 60 points and if you don't enter anything you get a message box that says you have not purchased it or if you enter zero or a negative number you get a message box you don't have any points you have zero points you have not purchased any books and have zero points so then you clear you put a zero in the label box and then you put the focus back on the text box. So we'll say this and we will run it. So one calculate. So we got five points. Let me clear it. We got two, we got 15 points, three, 30, clear, four, it should be 60. So if we put five in, we should get six points as well. Clear. So that works exactly how it's supposed to work. So if we put negative one, 
you do not have any books you have zero points okay so that puts zero in in the label here and it puts our focus back there and so if we put in zero you get zero points too so that is programming challenge 4-15 book club points in visual basic we'll clear that we'll close that that's the end of our calculations and the end of our visual basic for programming so we'll go over that so we'll do here that's the close button that's the clear button and this is the calculate button here this is where we declare our variables two of them integers use our text field as an input then here's our logic so that's that's everything there all right thanks for watching i'll see you later bye